of course. I've eaten a lot of Indian food for sure. Okay. And that's my time when I do eat Indian food. When I go back home to Australia, it's nowhere near as good. So um, <laughs> I make the most of my time in India to, to make the most of the dal maknis, also the biryanis. The, the biryanis, especially from Hyderabad, when I go there, that's the first thing I do because those are incredibly good. Once a cricketer, always a cricketer. But some of them actually become legends. And on this episode of The Legends, I am meeting Shane Watson. So how's it been back on the field with Legends League? Look, it's been a lot of fun. Um, you know, to have this opportunity to be able to play cricket at this stage of my, of my life um, is, I feel very, very, very fortunate. And to be able to reconnect, whether playing with some of the, you know, the, the, my great friends that, I, that I've got, but also some of my rivals, that um, yeah. some great rivals that I had as well, to be able to play with them and also to reconnect and play with some of the great players that um, I was fortunate enough to play against throughout my career as well with the Indian Maharajas and also... Uh, the Asian lines as well. So it's look, I feel very privileged and honoured to be here. Well, I'm from India, so a lot of questions from India coming your way. Yep. Brett Lee knows a lot about India, okay, <laughs> being from Australia. Yep. What about you? I've always had a great time. I feel incredibly supported in India, even more so at times than I do back home in Australia with my home, um, with the public back at home. So I've always absolutely loved my time in India. And a lot of my favourite memories of playing cricket have been um, in India. So. Um, yeah, it's always a great place to come back to. Yeah, what about food? Have you tried any of the Indian food? Of course, I've eaten a lot of Indian food for sure. Okay. And that's my time when I do eat Indian food. When I go back home to Australia, it's nowhere near as good. So um, <laughs> I make the most of my time in India to, to make the most of the dal maknis, also the biryanis. The, the biryanis, especially from Hyderabad, when I go there, that's the first thing I do because those are incredibly good. Wow, so are, would you consider yourself as a foodie? Are you? Oh, I love my food. Yeah, you yeah, do. Yeah, for sure, okay. I do. Yeah. <laughs> you know, while I was researching about you, I read that you had an eerie experience in a castle uh, <laughs> and you were scared of ghosts. <clears throat> yeah. Is that for real? Can you just tell us what happened exactly? And you went that and, was, yeah. yeah, that was 2005. I was um, 20, <laughs> 24 and I did spook myself out there. Um, it was a, a combination of staying in a haunted castle, which is known to be haunted, and then the Aussie boys who I was playing uh, playing with wound me up very nicely as well so it freaked, freaked me out a bit but those days are done now i've, I've moved on from ghosts um scaring me <laughs> and did you go and sleep with bretley i did on, yeah, on his on the floor of his bed my <laughs> my room was deep into the castle so i got a bit freaked out <laughs> i hope you're not scared to sleep alone anymore no, right? no, no, i got that out of my system pretty quickly <laughs> okay uh, how did the name butto came along in australia um a lot of the time that is used your nickname and sort of just shorten it a little bit so Watson, Watto, most most Watsons in Australia sort of nickname given as nicknames of Watto, so it just always stuck. Okay, great. We're going to play a fun game, which is called Who's Who. Uh, I'm going to name a few animals, and you've got to tell me which cricketer represents that. Animal. Okay. Shark. Gosh, the person that comes to mind is is Dale Stain because of those those eyes, those steely eyes that he always had, and also his longevity. <laughs> Okay. What about wolf? Gosh, it's tough. Um, <laughs> Someone who leads the pack. Gosh, I'd, yeah, I'd say, I'd say um, um, Ravinja Jadeja. He's okay. someone who's always led the pack. Um, he's incredibly good, and um, he's someone with those sort of long locks. Yeah. <laughs> Reminds me a little bit of a wolf. Okay. What about elephant? Domineering, yet you know, moving at his own pace. I'd say Brett Lee. Mm. Brett Lee certainly. Um, he knows. He knows what he wants. He's got a very good memory as well, as elephants do. Yeah. And um, he just gets stuff done. Okay. What about Tiger? Someone who's courageous yet composed? I'd have to say um, Emma Stoney. Mm. He's someone who's very much, whether it's a tiger or a lion, um, he's someone who's very much the leader of the pack um, and is very cool, calm, can like collected. So who's the most entertaining person in the locker room, if I may ask? I always, I always enjoy being around uh, Brett Lee. Yeah. He's, <laughs> he certainly makes makes every everyone laugh. Um, and he, he's very entertaining as well. He loves you know, playing the guitar and um, singing music and that as well. So he's always very entertaining. Yeah. 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 Okay, one last question. I know you've got to yeah. rush for the match and all yeah. the best for that. Thank you. Has it not been very, very challenging that because of your uh, sometimes injuries or physically, you know, not being fit, you've not been able to play that much. Are you now taking really good care of your health? You're physically as well as mentally now that you are retired. Yeah, look, I am looking after my, my health, of course. That's the most important thing in, in life is um, looking after your health. Um, yes, I had a lot of injury issues throughout my career um, and I'm still managing those now, even when I'm trying to play again. But, uh, 
but your health is the most important thing. It's the most important currency in your life is your health. So certainly the, the number one importance to me in my life. Okay, and how has it been on the field now? More friendship or competitiveness? No, friendship. We're, friendship. we're, here, to have a, we're here to have a great time. It's, we, feel, we all feel very fortunate to be able to have this opportunity to be able to play at this stage in our life. So, yeah, we, we're making the most of it. Yeah, wish you all the best. Thank, Thank you, you very much for, you know, spending these last minutes before your match with us. All the best for your match. Thank you.